Hello people! Another useful video regarding maintenance of electrical skateboards, particularly flex e board and this video is about tightening the belt on flex e board or any other electrical skateboard because they are most of them are exactly the same. The question was asked uh, on our Slick Revolution Boards Owners Club on Facebook. Thank you for the idea, guys. And there it is. So, what you need to start with is you need to take the wheel off and you need to take the belt guard off. So, let's do that now. So guys, as you can see, the wheel is off, the belt guard is off, so big question, how do you tighten up the belt? Well, surprise is that you don't. There's no need to tighten up this belt, there's no facility to do so, the design is not allowing to do so because it's not required. The belt is already preset length and the only thing you can do if you're not happy with the way your belt is behaving if it's a bit tight or too loose and it's stretched out you just need to simply replace the belt so there is no adjustment on the tension of the belt whatsoever it's set there's nothing you can do about it so while we're already here why not to take a look how to replace the belt so for starters as you saw take the wheel off take the belt cover off make sure you put all the little pieces on the side then it's very very simple what you need to do is just pull on the belt pulley slightly forward and take the belt of the uh, gears that are on the motor You can spin the motor if needed, it does help taking the belt off. So when you spin it, just keep on applying a bit of a pressure on the belt and the belt comes off. As simple as that. So let's take a look at this one more time, but from a different angle. So what you do is, you apply a bit of pressure by pulling the belt forward, spin the motor and keep on applying the pressure on the belt pulling it forward then pull the pulley a little bit forward as well the bigger pulley carry on with uh, pulling the belt and turning the motor and the big pulley again slightly and the belt comes off as simple as that let's take a look at the reason why Sometimes one belt could feel a bit different, tighter or looser uh, and you feel like you might need to adjust it, which we discussed you cannot really do. So, you can see in front of you three belts from the same, same manufacturer. All these belts are purchased from Slick Revolution website. And uh, if we apply the same pressure on the belt, they're all identical. And we stretch them exactly the same way as you can see. If you would then test the belts out, some of them do feel a little bit, slightly, slightly bit tighter than others. One of these belts is, is, is used, the other two are brand new. But they still feel just slightly different. So this could explain reasons why some of your belts might feel like they need tightening. And some don't bear in mind it's very precise length and manufacturing process is probably exactly the same but again it's a manufacturing process machines make all these and there's probably tolerance on each single belt so it's within a tolerance but might feel a bit different so the best thing to do just order a new belt and replace it and see if you will be happier 
So how to put the belt back on? So you take the other belt that you want to install and what you do is you put it over the large pulley first. Make sure you line up the teeth with the grooves in the belt. Then pull back on the other side of the belt and line up the teeth on the pulley or a gear on the motor. Then press on both the belt on the motor gears and the large pulley here. Spin it to make sure that it has sitting on its right place and you're done. Now you reinstate the wheel and the belt cover and you're good to go. Hope you liked the video. Please like, please subscribe. Any ideas for any future videos, please let me know in the um, comments below. Bye.